1955 International TD6. There, see it says right there. Diesel. This is the, uh, I think it was the smallest one that they made back then. Got the rear light. Here's the diesel side over here on the left. Injector pump. And there's the starting mechanism, arms and stuff. Fuel filters. Gasoline. Sediment bowl. Gas cup. This has got some really cool headlights on it too. And another interesting feature about this is it starts on gasoline. There's a spark plug in each cylinder. There's one of them right there. And then your carburetor's here. Magneto's down here. Right there with the distributor cap. Be sure you set your points at a 0 0.013, 13 thousandths, which is inside here somewhere. It's got a three brush generator. And there's the electric shutoff thing inside this place here. And here's the, when you pull this arm over here, Pull that back. That pushes this valve. I'll try to get a good picture of that valve. Pushes that valve down right about that line. No lower because the piston's going to be coming up for the diesel. And when you're starting a gasoline, that thing comes down. Gasoline comes in through here. Gets into this area, sparks. There's the spark plug. Then, when you warm up the engine enough, piston is warmed up and everything, that whole combustion chamber gets hot. Shut off the gasoline by popping that back up. When the, you push that handle forward, and the spark goes off, and the carburetor shuts down, no more gas going in, no more spark. And she takes right off. Let me get some of this stuff out of the way here. I'm going to do a demonstration. I don't know how to edit my video, so I'm going to have to do a continuous run here. I do have my tripod today. Which is kind of cool. I'll set that up and see if it works. Tripod set. This warm up. It's about a minute or so. 46 degrees.
Now when you shut this thing down, you got to bring it, the diesel back to an idle. Let it set for a while. Shut off the diesel and then turn the gasoline back on. Help cool down that uh, starting valve. guy up at the gasoline run and you shut the gasoline off pop the starting valve back in place and let it the engine cool down shut off so let's try that let's see how it works Yeah. 